Hello everyone, welcome to D4 Triple channel. Today we are going to see about how to use feed stamper module to handle entity reference field when you have entity reference field cardinality unlimited or more than one. So basically feeds module supports only to add single entity reference item to the uh, field. So you can use this module to add n number of entity reference value to a single field. So let me tell you how to do that. So here we already created feeds and we have mapping everything. So this would be the same what we did already. So the same uh, configuration and next tamper. So where you are going to add your plugins. So each field, whatever mapping you are having for each field, you can add a mapping here. And here we have a tags. I'm going to add a plugin here, add plugin. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to mention all my taxonomy term IDs with comma separated. So we are going to use the explore function here. You have to select explore. So I'm using comma. If you are using pipe symbol or whatever you want, you can give the string separator here and just say, submitting it. Once you added this plugin to this tag settings, next, what do you have to do? Uh, in your CSV file, you have to add more number. So 317, now I'll be adding 313. And let me add here 317, okay? So now we have uh, tags with multiple numbers in our CSV. So let me download this. It's downloaded. And now let me add a new feed. So it's a basic page with n number of tags. And I'm going to select the CSV which we downloaded. And then save and input. So now you can see six basic page items are created. So if you refresh, you will be able to see. So we added n number of tags in title one and title three. So let me show you both. So you can see both uh, reference are added and both reference are added. And if you select second one, you can see single item is referred to it. And that's it about today's video. If you like the video, please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye.